Hey Demon, um, so I'm just going to make a tutorial video here to show how to use this uh, autofill form. So it's a plugin for Firefox. And what you want to do is go to the link here. It's going to be in the comment in the uh, information section. Just this link here. And make sure that you do it in a, when you're already in Firefox. So if you don't have Firefox, you have to download it first. And then just open it and go to this link here. And when you do, it'll take you to this uh, page with the green button here. It says Add to Firefox. So you just click that. And it should be a pretty easy process here. It'll just download it real quick. And then it'll ask you to install it. So you just install. And then you'll have to restart. So just restart Firefox. Okay, and then you'll notice up here if you use Firefox already that this wasn't here before. This is your autofill forms button. And so now I'm going to show you what how we can use this to help create events quickly. So you want to go to a place where you post an event. So I'll just do this event combo website. Okay, so this is the form where you create an event. So most websites are going to do something like this, you know, where they'll have the address, your email, phone number, all that kind of stuff. So what we're going to be able to do here is you want to fill out everything that's not going to change. So like for the venue name, it's going to be the same for whatever event. The address will be the same, zip code, all of these things. So you want to fill this thing out as much as you can. The things that are going to change are like the details here. So whatever the event is, the details will be different each time. The event name, the category probably, and the day and time. Okay, so we leave those alone for now. But basically you just want to fill out this whole thing as much as you can for all the details that you know will stay the same every time that you come back here. Okay, and then once you have this thing filled out, what you want to do is you right click or you can do a control click on a Mac. And you'll see here like this, this new menu will pop up. And what you want to do is once this is filled out, you can do this here, add complete form as a profile. So you'll click that. Okay. And then you come up here to where this little pencil icon is, and the drop down menu here, you'll see that it'll automatically create a new profile with the name of the website. So you can rename these or you know, name them however makes sense for you. If you go in here into the settings, so this is the settings for my event combo uh, profile here. So you can see this is what the website will call the field, this area here where you post things into, and then the value will be whatever you typed in here. So I've already done this one. So you can see there's a bunch of information here that I've, that it's going to be the same every time that I post here. Okay, so what we use this form for is, so this is, you fill it out the first time, right? And the next time that you have an event here, this is when it's going to make it easier. But instead of having to fill out all of this address line, venue name, all this again, all you do is you make sure that you're in the right profile here. So we're at eventcombo.com. You go to your event combo profile here. Okay, and then you just click this pencil. So let's click it one time. Okay, and what it does, you can see everything that I need that's going to remain the same is already filled out for me. So the only things that I need to update now are the name here, the time and date, and the details of what it is. And even those, if it's a weekly thing, so say it's a program that happens every week, you have to repost it every week for some reason, then you can fill out everything on this page and then put that to a different profile maybe. 
and then you just click this pencil it'll fill the entire thing out for you then you can just you know create your event okay so i hope that helps explain how to use this add-on a little bit and i hope that it speeds up your 